have the first women's semi-finals knocking up on court here. Sarah Jane Perry, the number one seed against Emily Whitlock, the number three seed from Wales is the first match. And just one thing that I find immediately striking, uh, Parky, is that is the focus from Perry and just it's just like a different player from those first two rounds it's almost like she knows like right you know this is this is serious now uh, she's much more patient from the start just there's much more purpose and intensity about her body language Good for Whitlock. She's taking time away from Perry. Yeah, stop dead in her tracks. <laughs> it's an interesting See. reaction from, <laughs> from Perry. It was quite a, a high trickle boast, but it did the job. Great pickup from Whitlock. Full stretch, looked fine to me. Just yeah, nudged it, get. nudged yeah. it in. Brilliant, brilliant from Whitlock. Very impressive start. Oh, <laughs> do drop in. What a roller. I mean, it's a big smile there from Sarah Jane Perry, which is good to see. Yeah. I mean, there's, there's absolutely nothing you can do about yeah, Whitlock trying to force a little bit herself there. That's a great yeah. shot. Slight delay in the swing. Eight, five. Drop Brilliant. Very, very high. Far too high, but a lot of that is pressure. Bit of a nervy tie break this, Vanessa. It's a question of who wants it most, I think. Who can hold their nerve? Oh, oh. what a shot. Talk about holding the nerve. And now, 30 all. Yeah, I mean, she's pretty much held her nerve. Just not going away in this tie break. There it is again. Yeah, and that was just that slight hold. Big roar. Uh, no. <laughs> You're waiting 18, for it. 16, I think uh, there's an internal one going on, <laughs> Vanessa. <Yes. laughs> she likes to be the aggressor. She likes to be in front. She likes to be the person determining how the game is played and she has really been unable to do that. Three, two. Yeah, a lot of the matches you see with Perry, she's... Uh, yeah, brilliant. And again. Oh, wow. What a save. Another game ball save from Whitlock. Brave shot, just millimetres above the tin here. Doesn't read that bow, Stanley Whitlock. I mean, I guess that most people don't, but it's a bit of a favourite for, for Perry. Well, Perry pointing at her knee, saying she needs a physio, I think. It's too much time and space there given to Perry. Fantastic width.
Yeah, that is beautiful. Fantastic love. I mean, it just it took about 20 minutes Nine. to come down, didn't it? <laughs> so much height on it. And it just sailed through nice and slow. The swing there. Oh, good play. Oh, beautiful. Fantastic Great play from play. Whitlock again. This is getting a little bit edgy now for Perry. Eight, Remember ten, that uh, that comeback yesterday. Ten love down. James Allstruck nearly, <laughs> nearly went all the way, didn't he? It's getting very edgy for for George Parker. Perry's got to be careful here. Oh, oh I knew well that was played. coming. It had to happen at some point, didn't it? She had Eleven too many points That's to play with there. Three that ten-five breathing space that she had. Very entertaining. So Sarah Jane Perry, the number one seed and defending champion, wins 7-11, 18-16, 13-11, 11-8 in 62 minutes. She's through to the final again. And um, I guess two real crucial games in there, the second game and the third game, which were tie breaks and, um, and, and really tested you to the limit. How did you feel out there? Uh, yeah, I don't, I don't feel like I played my best squash at all by any means today, but I think you know, some of that's credit to Emily for, for playing good squash and like, not letting me. Uh, get away with anything that wasn't <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> that wasn't really good. Uh, she played some great stuff, and I, I see, you know I said that too at the end. Um, uh, so you know, just pleased to get through really, and um, see if we can improve for tomorrow. What, uh, what do you think? I was going to ask your opinion. And actually, who's going to who's going to win out in terms of imposing their their game plan and their style? Well, one thing I was going to say earlier is that result at St George's Hill, that's a really quite a bouncy court. That's a great shot. Appreciated Seven, by eight. Evans. What a get. Yeah. Oh, it's a good hold. Brilliant. And she's oh, got that as well. Back. And again. Oh, oh wow. <laughs> Fantastic. Three times. Fantastic. Three times. Even the speed of Kennedy can't recover and now after going the wrong way three times. I mean, Daniel. against most mere mortals, that would have been three points in a row for Tesney Evans. missed it she guessed right Tesney Evans she was in the right spot but just couldn't Kane time it correctly Kennedy leads. One game to love. Well, that's a lovely play from Evans And again. Seven. Well, completely flummoxed there, Tesney Evans. Ten, just stuck eight. to the, the middle of the Game court. Ball. Yeah, clever shot. Ten all. It was, but look at the, the poor return of serve here. It was too high. There it is. Well, that's huge. It's absolutely huge well, for Tesney ten, Evans. She desperately win. needed that. Kennedy pulls away, gets a little bit of a buffer here. Nice. That's the hold you were talking about, Vanessa. And out, two, four. Got there nice and early from both of these players. It's 
It's showing a lot of passion on there. Oh, nice. Oh. <laughs> no, that was one too many. You've got your sound effects and as well. <laughs> She's reading everything. I think she got that. Oh, She's just unhappy because it was tight. Straight to there, Tesney Evans. <laughs> oh, that is a huge roar from Tesney Evans. Okay, Evans a little bit of a lifeline there. Yeah, if she, if she can just get that backhand boast as good as the forehand boast, she'd be really dangerous. Nice. Get that. And out, six, five. Strength area behind the service backs on box, sorry, on the... Would you apologise then or just not bother? Well, feel it's dishonest. Kind of, it's kind of the done thing, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. but Nice finish. Very nice finish there from Kennedy. And out. Nine, eight. Oh, oh there wow. it is. What a winner that was. What a finish. Fantastic finish there Three from, from Kennedy. One. Superb performance 14, from the unseeded 12, 10, English 12, player. 11, 5, 11, 9. Fantastic. 56 minutes. Georgina Kennedy takes out the number two seed. This was your first semi final, but you're through to the final final, the big one. Um, <laughs> that's presumably what you came here to do and believed you could do, and you've done it. How does that feel? Yeah, um, I, I, can't, I honestly can't believe it. Um, obviously, I came into this tournament with full confidence that I could potentially get to the final, but also with full confidence that I could get knocked out in the first round. So um, I'm so happy to be standing here. I mean, I just want to say well played to Tesney. I mean, she's had a really, really tough year with her injuries and stuff, so it's great to see her back playing to a good level. And, um, yeah, I've, I mean... The games were so close, could have gone either way. I'm literally just risking everything with these shots at the end, so they could have gone up or down. So it's just lucky in the end. But yeah, so I'm so, so happy to be in the final tomorrow.